for? Look at me in that box that says PlayStation 2. I can hardly contain my excitement. What is it? Oh, I would have never guessed a PlayStation 2. Alright, let's get this thing going. And as you can see, it's in terrible condition. Disk drive faceplate's missing, and I'm pretty sure the laser's completely dead. It doesn't read CDs or DVDs. Let's get this cover off. Oh, how convenient. It just comes right off. I totally didn't just undo all the screws before I recorded. Stamped with a date. September 2002. Wow, this thing's extra vintage. Extra brittle. Giant clump. To repair the damage on this console. I'm sure, this will fix it. And as you can see, the internal battery is also dead because it doesn't keep the time. It better not turn off because I've got no way to turn it back on. Do something. The wrong way. How can the salt water test just ever be fun? Do something! It's not doing anything! It's gonna be a boring video! Oh, it blew up! Oh no, error! I hope my hand wasn't in the way. Probably was. Sounds like something popped. Smells like it. That's what happens when there's a built-in power supply. Connect those controllers that I don't have. Well, I've got one for another video. Disk drive, read it. Oh, the copper ball is getting in the way. Electrical hazard. Is that it? Is that what it wants to do? Guess so. Fall down yet, it's not destroyed to bits. Oh, everything's just tangling everywhere. So much metal. So I'll just get the spot. Yeah, it's just a big hunk of metal left. Take those insides. Come on, I want to get to those fancy Sony chips. What is it? The graphic synthesizer and the emotion engine? What is this one? Just says Sony Computer Entertainment. Yeah, this is entertaining. Oh, it's just getting salt water everywhere.
There's nothing else left to break. It just ends up being a squished in bit of metal. I'm sure no one can use that. I was in another fancy chip graphics synthesizer. Synthesizer's graphics! Yeah, I think that's it for the console. PlayStation 2.